Some shit like that, you know what I'm saying? Oh, brother, what it do? Gang, gang. You know what's cracking with y'all, man? We here to talk about my baby. A lot of y'all's new gun, you know what I'm saying? And one of the hottest things on the market. The G2C, baby. Now, a lot of y'all know me. I mean, this is my main thing right here. Uh, a lot of you guys thought I didn't have self-protection and my butter do. Just to let y'all know, you know what I'm saying? We good. We clear. You know what I'm saying? I, I just leave this out for right now. Well, I'll put it back in there. That don't bang in there right that. Safety on. The G2C. Let's talk about it. This firearm is on the market for 200, 300. In some states, I've heard 350. But I got it for 250. I've heard of people that got it for 200. Nice, compact firearm made by Taurus. This is the G2C model. Okay, not the S or the full size. Uh, so this is the double stacked 12 round one plus one compact boy. Got me a little ADE tack light on there. It does have the stroll feature on it. I love it. Uh, if you've seen in a lot of my old videos, I've put at least, I know I put a thousand rounds through it, but I'll say I met around 11, 1200 at this particular point. I personally ain't had no issues. So I, I really can't complain. One thing I do like about this light, which I got off Amazon, thrifty is it is a quick detach, you just slide it right on off. Good idea what it's gonna look like outside of the box minus the grip. Compared to my hand, I mean, my thumb, my, my finger falls right on it. So you're gonna get some pretty decent little uh, sights. Yeah. I like these sights a lot, set of them O-ring sights. I don't like that, but I am gonna put some um, knights in here just for the heck of it. Go ahead and pull this out. Now the trigger pull is one thing I don't really enjoy about this thing right here. I'm gonna fix it though. Upgrade coming soon. But you got your pull. You got your wall right there. So when you go to the range and you spend some time with this firearm, you can get used to that. Um, I just want it to be just a little bit, you know, less draggy. I am personally used to it, but I do have my days where it kind of throws me off how long I have to pull for it to really get that shot off. But other than that, main thing, I usually take this when I'm going to the gas station. It's really wherever I'm going. Um, depending on the situation, I'll, have to, I'll slide this on or off. That's kind of why I like the detach. I'll even sometimes still bring this, just put it in the glove department. And maybe I'm out late, you know what I'm saying? Whoop, ready to go. Any nighttime situation, you know what I'm saying? In the night. I got plenty of footage shooting this firearm. Um, I'll put the latest footage of me going to the range with it and uh, trying to make some groupings with it here. So when it comes to you know your controls, you go over, you got you got the slide release, you got your safety up and down, pin locks, you got your mag release and all that good jazz. You even got on both sides this imprint where you kind of can rest your thumb and on both sides has an imprint where you can rest your index. So I guess this guy ampedextrous finger placement. Y'all know what I'm trying to say. But like I said, it's really nice. I uh, recommend if you're gonna get into the firearms and you don't wanna really go haywire on getting something really expensive, I'll say start out with something like this. 
make sure you keep her nice and greased up even though i haven't cleaned this firearm i'll say since 700 rounds and i'm at around 1100 1200 rounds and she's still trucking along on the tracks no grease no problems as far as concealed carry i mostly rock her in this fashion uh, the little side knobs for the quick release are a little uncomfortable um, and also I haven't found a holster because I'm probably it doesn't exist for this little light and this firearm so for the most part I just rock it like this and I'll probably just put this in a glove compartment something like that and call it a day but most of the time this is usually only on my firearm when I'm at home so that's it for this review right here. I'm gonna get y'all some more gun range uh, footage coming up, I think, next. You already know what it is. It's True Nation. Gang, gang. <laughs>